हेलो गाइस टुडे इन दिस वीडियो लेक्चर आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस अनदर यूनिट व्हिच इज इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ पॉलीनोमियल्स यू कैन सी हियर आई हैव रिटन अ पॉलीनोमियल इक्वेशन ऑन बोर्ड व्हिच इज एन एट डिग्री पॉलीनोमियल एंड हाउ आई हैव डिसाइडेड दिस इज एन एट डिग्री बेस्ड ऑन द हाईएस्ट एक्सपोनेंट ऑफ x as n being the highest here that's where this polynomial is nth polynomial n at degree polynomial so if the value of n becomes 3 then what will be this polynomial let's see if the value of n is 3 then this polynomial will become f3x is equal to a3x cube plus a two x square plus a one x plus a zero, and as any if the exponent is zero of any base, then this value will become one. That's why here a naught into one is a naught. That's why this value is a naught. So as you can see here, that uh, highest exponent of x is three. That's why this polynomial will become cubic polynomial. what it will become cubic polynomial and if value of n is 2 then what will be this polynomial again let's see a2x square plus a1x plus a not as here you can see highest degree of uh, uh, of x is 2 that's why this polynomial will become now quadratic polynomial and if value of n becomes 1 then what will be this polynomial again let's see f1x is equal to a1x plus a not so here you can see highest degree of x is 1 that's why this polynomial will become linear polynomial as highest degree of x is 1 and now last condition is if n is equal to 0 so if n is 0 then what will be this function again this will be a not x raised to power 0 as here the degree in x is 0 so what will be this polynomial now this polynomial is named as zero polynomial because degree in x is 0 so as you should be familiar now with all these polynomials if highest degree in x is 3 then this polynomial will be known as cubic polynomial and if the highest degree in x is 2 then this polynomial will be known as quadratic polynomial and if the highest degree in x is 1 then this polynomial will be known as linear polynomial and if it is 0 then this will be known as zero polynomial i'll be discussing polynomials in detail in the next video lectures based on all these four polynomials so please keep in mind all these four polynomials for the next video lectures thank you